Hey guys, how's everyone doing? Welcome to the uh, Injective Hackathon opening ceremony. Hey guys, this is uh, Eric Chen, co-founder and CEO of uh, Injective Labs. We're a core contributor of uh, the Injective uh, blockchain ecosystem. And we're uh, incredibly excited to be here and have everyone participating in this while we're kicking off the ceremony here. So before we get to the uh, Injective Virtual Hackathon, I want to share our building journey at Injective first. Uh, as a short overview, Injective is an interoperable blockchain built for next generation DeFi applications. It's built on top of Cosmos SDK as a smart contracts enabled blockchain uh, using proof of stake consensus. So how does Injective get started? Um, what's a founder journey starting to uh, build Injective as a layer one blockchain? Um, and so one of the issues around some of the uh, DeFi infrastructure and the DeFi applications, uh, especially back in you know, 2018 and 2019 and becoming increasingly apparent today is all the issues around uh, finality, all the issues around race conditions, all the issues around uh, minor extractable value, front running, et cetera. And for me and my co-founder Albert, we realized that a better solution must be presented from the base layer, from the ground up. Um, and a lot of my um, earlier uh, formative years uh, were spent in Hong Kong when I was really young and experienced a lot of difficulty and barriers uh, that came with the information and technology being centralized. So building a fully decentralized end-to-end, uh, -end, you know, uh, permissionless and censorship resistant infrastructure uh, became kind of uh, a very early on uh, predisposition for me. Um, centralizing uh, access to internet creates these knowledge gates uh, and slows down the speed of information and the trustful um, kind of uh, a monetary uh, distribution because everyone is trying to access the same things at the same time. And over time, I, you know, I started stumbling ac across programs like BitTorrent, LimeWire, uh, et cetera. And that's when, you know, for a 14 year old or 12 year old, my mind was completely blown. Uh, these are of course, you know, file sharing protocols uh, and the fact of something uh, that existed within a digital world that is P2P, not controlled by anyone. Uh, and it's absolutely unique with a fully decentralized uh, form of identity and ownership and uh, self-sovereignty uh, was, uh, became a strong inception of my early belief. And from then on, you know, going to school, studying cryptography only led me to naturally work in this industry and start a DeFi infrastructure, uh, a, a decentralized infrastructure that can scale adoption uh, and usage to billions of people uh, and to truly empower people uh, financially uh, with uh, all the amazing applications that are currently being built on. And of course, uh, building a DeFi protocol is not simple. Uh, Injective has a global network of contributors who have built DeFi protocols uh, and already in, uh, previously encountered some of the major challenges uh, that developers are facing every day. Uh, early contribution and upgrade to the chain is based on the global wealth uh, of knowledge that the Injective community has. And other DeFi protocols are also starting to notice that when it comes to, especially the DeFi, Injective has a solution being needed. And that's why Injective shares the mission to create a more free and inclusive financial system through decentralization. And of course, our mission is just getting started. Some stats to share about uh, uh, Injective and our current milestones. Uh, Injective is a blockchain that has far surpassed a number of uh, industry benchmarks. To date, uh, since you know, roughly a little bit over a year uh, launch, um, it has exceeded you know, 193 million transactions, $9 billion in cumulative trading volume, not a single uh, chain hold and uh, network downtime with uh, 350,000 community members all over the world. Um, as the Injective community started to grow, uh, the scope of Injective also grew. And at, at its current point, Injective is customized, uh, tailored, and bespoke built for uh, DeFi and any type of financial application developers. It is unmatched primitive. Um, our team is made of the builders and operators that have, that have a history within you know, traditional finance, trading, and technology, and uh, any type of uh, uh, kind of a decentralized system uh, uh, background. Our unique set of experiences provided us with the knowledge to build the premier DeFi application. Uh, the base layer L1 that they're built with must be powerful, fast, and tailored to solve solutions that DeFi developers will inevitably run into. And that's why Injective was built and we have you know, all these uh, following kind of a financial primitive to truly empower uh, decentralized fin uh, finance developers. Uh, some of them are, uh, include uh, the 
uh, inter uh, order book, uh, on-chain order books, uh, derivatives, uh, binary options, uh, self-executing smart contract layer. And you can combine these primitives together in order to build truly innovative financial applications that would not be possible anywhere else. Uh, it's also, you know, right off the bat, highly interoperable. Every single partnership and integration to the chain level is going to be focused on providing the best po uh, possible infrastructure for Web3 Finance to make sure that developers are taking on, uh, you know, the challenge and kind of uh, taking on a new uh, layer one ecosystem is going to have the best start possible. Interoperability for us is at the core of every single product and application, the ability for users to utilize any type of asset and to enjoy true composability across chain is highly important. It's uh, injective at this moment is perhaps one of the most interoperable block, uh, blockchains. Uh, of course, we are IBC enabled, which lets you access chains such as Osmosis and Juno um, and you know, uh, Terra, et cetera, uh, with ease. Uh, we've also built one of the first bridges to Ethereum and became the first Cosmos space chain to have MetaMask uh, compa uh, compatibility, which is a major gateway to onboard Ethereum users. Uh, since then, we have also added access uh, to new chains such as Polkadot through a bridge to Moonbeam Parachain. And with our upcoming integration uh, with, you know, Wormhole, with, uh, um, you know, all, all the upcoming latest and greatest bridge solutions, it will also allow us to access a number of uh, EVM chains and non-EVM chains, such as Polygon, uh, Solana, et cetera, for a very, very first time. Uh, and, you know, to date, the integration with Wormhole has already added, uh, you know, 10 more prominent blockchains to the injective network. Sorry. And one of the biggest of which is, of course, the new Cosmosm smart contract layer, which is out, uh, allows for a range of new applications to be built on top of Injective. Injective's Cosmosm implementation is uniquely different, allowing Injective to be the only blockchain capable of supporting automated executing smart contracts. And of course, we're con uh, continuing to push out new innovations. Uh, last week, uh, it also launched uh, the first ever uh, interchain Solana SVM rollup cascade, which allows Solana adapts and, uh, and any type of a developer that are familiar with the Solana uh, uh, environment and ecosystem to be built and utilized on Injective, uh, bringing Solana and Cosmos interoperability to complete new heights. Cascade helps unlock the $9 billion plus Solana developer ecosystem for Injective. And this new integration will not only attract a new audience uh, to the Solana eco e uh, ecosystem, but also enable uh, Cosmos users uh, to utilize popular Solana dApps deployed on top of Injective resulting in uh, what increased what uh, what three adoption across the board uh, we would really appreciate your support so with what an injective is uh, equipped we're excited to sh uh, start the first injective global hackathon uh, the ultimate builder event for creating next generation DeFi application supported by uh, the injective ecosystem venture group this serves as the foremost launchpad for developers to revolutionize uh, the world of DeFi. We've gathered over 400 passionate individuals here to learn about the most innovative uh, blockchain technology, to connect with each other, and of course, to win from the competition. But most importantly, we are here to pioneer a completely new financial uh, ecosystem. And of course, this wouldn't have happened without the support behind Injective and contri uh, contributors to this hackathon. Uh, here, I wanna give a shout out to the Injective Ecosystem Venture Group, which is the uh, largest consortium uh, assembled within the broader Cosmos system to date. Uh, consistently to help projects who are looking to build on top of Injective uh, and anything related to DeFi and Cosmos. It has been put together by some of the largest institutions uh, across Web3 and traditional finance, including Pantera Capital, Jump Crypto, uh, Kraken Ventures, KuCoin Ventures, Delphi Digital, Gate Labs, Flow Traders, IDG Capital. And also huge thanks to Wormhole, PIF, Eclipse, and Notify for supporting the hackathon by la uh, launching bounty programs. And for the hackathon, you can find all details you need to know uh, regarding rules and eligibility for, through injective.com slash hackathon. I want to emphasize, keep your work original, start brainstorming with your team members, be absolutely creative. And before we create a more inclusive financial system, we also need to create an uh, inclusive building environment. And we're here to revolutionize the world together as an inclusive community to so treat other hackers with uh, the utmost uh, respect. So what is there to expect? Um, first of all, there are four weeks of online events with nonstop panels, uh, workshops, office hours, developer calls, one-on-one uh, -on -one mentoring session with our dev team, 
Um, uh, and this will all you know, help you shape and build your project uh, in the fastest and most efficient path forward. Uh, there are two tracks and four boundary programs. Uh, you get mentorship from industry leaders, first-hand learning and building experience, fundraising opportunities, you know, uh, totaling up to one million, um, and also technical guidance from the Injective Labs team with um, exclusive surprise benefits. Uh, we will reveal these uh, benefits during the hackathon gradually. And here's the uh, exciting part, which are the prizes. And these are you know, only a fraction of uh, what the total reward pool is uh, coming from a range of external uh, investments and grants, uh, et cetera. Uh, the grand prize will be thirty thousand uh, dollars, with second place being uh, twenty and third place being ten. And there's also a community choice reward of uh, uh, five thousand. There's also the wormhole bounty program of uh, five thousand uh, and uh, PIF Eclipse Notify bounty program, all coming at five thousand dollars. And here's the hackathon event schedule. There are four weeks of virtual event. It's a great time for you to learn, practice. Be professional, uh, the tools you need, and uh, we, we can all go over the goal uh, uh, of each week. And week one is the launch week. Uh, the launch week will include, you know, opening ceremony, which is this one, uh, alongside with panels where industry leaders of the injective ecosystem will share their experience to guide you in getting started. Uh, the week two is learn week, where, where there are multiple technical panels with uh, some of our top developers and some of the top ecosystem developer workshops. The hackers will receive step-by-step uh, -step guidance on how to get started with uh, Injective's world-class financial, uh, financial and uh, uh, financial infrastructure and Web3 modules. Week three is build week. Uh, it's time to continue building, jumpstart your project, and uh, connect directly with uh, uh, mentors to bring uh, your final product to life. And week four is the most exciting yet with demo week, where you get to consult with mentors and further polish your project. Uh, and make sure you get ready to submit your project by May 4th. And here are the agendas for, for you to kind of memorize and check out. And this week we schedule uh, you know, one uh, panel and one workshop each day to help you get started on everything. So this is how your uh, building journey at the, the Injective Hackathon will look like. Join the Injective Discord server where all the communications will happen. Uh, unlock all the hackathon channels with the hacker role. Get familiar with the resources to start brainstorming your project. We prepare you know, a one-stop uh, Notion doc for all information needed, and it can be found within the Discord server. Find teammates, find mentors, uh, and you know, in the teammates channel, you can introduce yourself and gather your team. You can also join panel and workshops, learn from experienced industry experts, attend office hours, and continue building. And here's what you need to prepare when you're ready to submit your project. I have huge reminders that after uh, creating your project through the portal, you can always update the information. So whenever you're ready, you can click the submission button before the deadline, May 4th. And once you submit the project, it can't be changed. May the force be with you. And of course, for judges, we've uh, invited uh, industry experts from leading project BC to join as judges. Uh, your submission will be evaluated through seven different uh, aspects. Project sustainability. Can this project uh, continue to grow and evolve over time? And is it built to be timeless? Uh, design. Is the user experience and design of the project uh, well thought out? Uh, security. Is the project properly tested? Have the relevant test case has been covered with all unit tests? Uh, originality and inv uh, innovation. How creative and unique is the project itself? Mass usability. Is the idea uh, feasible? How adaptable is it across other ecosystems and integrations? Uh, ecosystem impact. How impactful and useful this submission is uh, for the larger injective ecosystem? And uh, technical complexity. Does the interaction with uh, injective demonstrate quality software development? How well uh, was the idea executed by the developer? Does the project work as it's designed? Uh, what is the level of skill uh, or knowledge required to build a project? And what's next for injective is twofold. Uh, Continue to push the boundary for new protocols to launch within Injective, and then to grow the ecosystem by partnering off with uh, some of the best builders within the larger Web3 system. And now uh, we look forward to seeing you joining the Injective ecosystem and may the force be with you.